So happy Wednesday and welcome back to The Average Fisherman, everybody. I'm pretty excited about this. I've, I, I got everything rigged up and everything, and I just wanted to show it to you guys real quick before you'll see it in one of my future videos. This is the combination that I'm going to be using. This is that Shakespeare Direct Drive True, uh, True Axis Model EA. And I think it was made sometime in the, the mid to late 70s is, is when this one was. Um, very popular. There were some changes made to it. Um, the reason I say late 70s, no, actually it can't be the late 70s because it doesn't have the spool release here. So this one's probably late 60s, okay? Um, the late 70s models did have the spool release right here, which this one does not have. Um, but anyway, I have it hooked up on this. I know it's going to be upside down, but browning boron rod. Oops. And of course it has no hook keeper on it. But I tried to stay true to form, so this is a quarter ounce, it's black, but it's a lead weight. And this is a standard shank worm hook on just a ribbon tail worm here. And I have it rigged up with 10 pound Berkeley Trilene Big Game. So that's what I'm going to be using. So there you go, the Browning Boron. <laughs> Let me show you the specs on this thing. Uh, there we go. I don't know if that's showing up just right. That's a little better. Okay. So that's the specs on this thing. I know it's mostly faded off, but it is, you know, early 80s rod, late 70s, you know, mid mid to late 60s reel, you know, old pistol grip thing here. And that's how you attach the, um, the reel to the base. And, you know, period, period uh, um, accurate monofilament. And so this is going to be used soon. I have a trip that I'm going on tomorrow. I'm going to be doing some more bluegill fishing with the flugers and stuff in the kayak. Um, so this isn't going to be in the video that I'm doing tomorrow. But uh, I, I wanted to wait and actually catch this on video the first time I actually try to use this. So that way you, uh, you guys can get all the, the laughs and giggles at my expense as possible as I try to uh, learn how to use this old ancient bait caster. But this is going to be the combination that you guys are going to see me use soon. Let me back away. In fact, I'm trying to show it up close. The Brownie Boron with the Shakespeare, um, Shakespeare Direct Drive True Axis Model EA. I keep forgetting that, but that's what's going to be. This is going to be one of the combos I use. Um, I'm going to be attaching some of the older stuff to a different rod, and I'll be using those soon. So look forward to this. I'm looking forward to this. Tomorrow's going to be a kayak fishing day. I hope everybody's safe. Everybody's having a good time and tight lines, my friends.